Hi guys, in this video I'm going to go over the process of electron capture. Basically, electron capture describes a situation where the nucleus of the atom has far too many protons. It's, it's not stable with that many protons there. And what happens is an electron from the K shell, the lowest shell of the atom, is sucked in and that turns that proton into a neutron. So really the atomic mass stays the same, but a proton gets turned into a neutron. In the process where the electron and the neutron, when they come together making a, a neutron, a neutrino is also shot out and some x-rays are often emitted. Another pretty interesting thing is uh, the Auger effect, meaning when one of these electrons are captured, um, there's a lot of extra energy that's emitted, and sometimes it shoots out the outermost electron. But that's getting a little bit too much there, right? So basically, electron capture occurs when an electron, electron symbol is an E with a zero and a negative one, gets captured by a nucleus, uh, turning the proton of that nucleus into a neutron. Uh, let me show you with some mathy problems. Uh, a very uh, common example of electron capture uh, exists in aluminum-26. All right, here's aluminum. Aluminum is right here. So it has an atomic number of 13, and it's going to capture an electron. So here is my electron. It's got a zero on top, a minus one on the bottom. So um, the results are pretty easy, see? Uh, 26 plus 0 is 26. 13 and negative 1 is 12. As you can see, the atomic number is reduced by 1. That's the point of electron capture. There are too many protons in there. Uh, you got to turn that sucker into a neutron. Um, and here, now that it has an atomic uh, number of 12, we can see that uh, this aluminum turned itself into a magnesium. So the parent nuclide uh, becomes a magnesium. Here the parent nuclide is aluminum 26 and the daughter nuclide becomes magnesium 26. Pretty simple. Let's do one more sample. Another very uh, common example of electron capture uh, occurs in uh, beryllium-7. Here, uh, as you can see, the atomic number is 4. It's going to capture an electron, 0, and negative 1 on the bottom. 7 and 0 is 7. 4 and negative 1 is 3. So as you can see, this thing gets turned into a lithium. I hope that clarifies things, and thanks for watching.